Okie dokie, folks. It's been a long time since I've uploaded a video. I'm still working on the Ranger project. Um, I sold the Red Ranger um, about a month and a half ago. And I'm still working on finding batteries for the white one. But I thought I'd share my most recent acquisition. So this is a 2014 Fiat 500e. Fully electric. Uh, Bosch powertrain. And Samsung SDI batteries. Same cells used in the earlier versions of the BMW i3. It's got a 24 kilowatt hour pack with a range of about 70 to 90 miles, depending on how it's driven. And I plan on doing a couple of small modifications to this one. Um, Fiat didn't really do a good job underneath as far as aerodynamics go. It's got big open space behind the rear bumper here. And that's the battery pack, as you can see there. So I plan to add probably a plastic sheet that covers the bottom of this. And same up front. Which has got just all open. You can see the motor there. I thought about maybe lowering it too, but it already scrapes the front bumper as is. I could probably take the, the air dam off, but I think it's fine as is. Inside, it looks pretty similar to a regular gasoline Fiat 500. Um, it's got a push button gear select, so you've got park, reverse, neutral, and drive. The dash display has a couple of different modes that you can go through. Um, of course, it's got steering wheel controls and all. All of the 500Es, I'm pretty sure, come standard with heated seats, um, which is a lot more efficient than using the climate control. Um, air conditioning is pretty efficient, but the heater is not, so it'll draw a lot of power. If we move to the back here, as you can see, I've got one of the seats folded down, but there's not a whole lot of space back there. With the seats folded down, it'll fit a fair amount of stuff, and with the seats folded up, it's a pretty small cargo capacity. Sorry about the groceries. Charge port is in the back here. Charges on level one or level two, up to 6.6 .6 kilowatts, um, which will charge the car from empty to full in about four hours. The company that I work for, um, we build some DC fast charging kits for a couple of different cars, including the Toyota RAV4 EV, the original Tesla Roadster, and the Mercedes B-Class. And this is going to be the, one of the next cars on our list. So this might end up being the, uh, the guinea pig for our fast charging kit. Um, and that should allow it to charge to 80% in probably about 25 minutes, give or take, um, would be about my estimate. But yeah, that's it. Fiat 500e. Hopefully we'll get to do some new and exciting stuff to this car.